the training ground is generally where it will happen the most because it's trying to get that fine line as a like a manager tries and a coach tries to get that fine line of competitiveness without yeah. getting injuries. <laughs> and sometimes a player will go because they want to win so much, it's in their nature, they'll go that extra yard t- t- no matter what. And sometimes it's over the line. Like you see a rough tackle on a Saturday. You know, that happens in training as well. And when you do it on a teammate, they try to take a little bit more offence to it. And because you can't get a red card for reacting, sometimes <laughs> you can react more physical than what, you know, when I've been involved in, I remember there was a, uh, a training session, I won't name names because it was actually quite nasty, but there was a Scottish lad and uh, that, I, that I played with and uh, there was a midfielder, both both centre midfielders there were, playing against each other in a training match, just a uh, uh, five side. And one was chirping all the time, like giving, giving stick and like, oh, we're winning hard, all this. And, and then he'd fly into a few tackles and basically just being a you know, loud mouth and giving it this, giving it that. And the other midfield, I, I don't think generally liked him as a person anyways, but anyways, uh, he was really quiet, reserved, a really nice fella. And no one expected this from him. And all of a sudden, he just walked up to him, punched him square on the chin, blokes flat out on the floor and then just walked off. Just walked off the training ground, walked in, and went, "Yeah, sorry, gaffer," and just walked in. The Scottish lad just, and I thought, "Don't mess with the Scottish boys." <laughs> when they get, when you wind them up to a certain degree, it's hit out, off he went. He, he didn't care. And then he had a, he had a meet with the manager after and said, "I couldn't take it anymore." He goes, "Yeah, that's fair enough." The manager's fine with him. So sometimes, you know, sometimes those things happen. The bloke who got hit, he, he wasn't best pleased at all, and he was pushing for him to get out of the club, but. No, it didn't happen. So it was uh, a few things have happened. You, you get these incidents, and it's just part and parcel. Of but if you never got any kind of friction or that, then you'd be worried as a manager because, mm. again, it, that that's the passion and the care that professional athletes have. Mm. You know, if they, if they're not winning, they get upset. If you if you can accept winning, uh, losing, then you're in the wrong the wrong profession. Then.